Good evening, everyone. Welcome back. Welcome, welcome. I'm the God of Myth, and we're going to be getting back to some StarCraft 2. Let's get her booted up. Good evening. I want the smoke. How are you doing tonight? There it goes. All right, getting back in. Let's see, where did we leave off? I think we just finished one of the Protoss missions from the Ehan crystal that Zeratul left us, so we can get in and finish a couple of other missions. <clears throat> All right. I want to finish this one for sure. Who falls up is ripe for the taking, man. Every voice that was ever raised against Minsk is pinned up inside those walls. We let all them prisoners loose, and he'll never know what hit him. Just let me know when you're ready to pull the trigger. All right. Where's Tosh? I thought he'd be here by now. He already left the ship. I thought you... Sir, we have an incoming transmission. It's highly encrypted. Patch it through. Well, well. The infamous Jim Rayner. My name is Nova. We should talk. Now, what would one of Menk's pet ghosts have to say to me? Tosh is lying to you. Get Tosh on comms. I'm sure he's listening in anyway. Encrypted or not. We Spectres be the future. You just couldn't handle it, little girl. Every ghost that became a Spectre has gone on a psychotic killing spree. The ones I've captured are held in New Folsom. Don't listen to her, brother. Help me bust the Spectres from New Folsom. And we'll bring down Minx together. Tosh wants to reactivate his Spectre buddies, using the substances you helped him collect. New Folsom is full of psychopathic killers. Do you really want to release them into the galaxy? I be helping you against Minsk. And my people will too. She won't even join you. He's a psychotic time bomb. He'll be on your side, right up until he puts a knife in your back. This be the moment of truth. Make your choice. I'm gonna help Tosh. Because I want the Spectres. You should have told me what you were really planning, Tosh. But I'll take your word over Dominion Assassins any day. We've come this far together. May as well see it through. You've made a poor choice, Mr. Rayner. I knew I could count on you, brother. Now let's go and bust open New Folsom. Uploading New Folsom data now. Feast your eyes on this, brother. They're locked down tight. Nova must have tipped them off. We're gonna need an army to break into that place now. Even an army couldn't get you in there. But one man, one spectre in the right place, can find a way in. Then our progress is all up to you, Tosh. I'll push my boys as hard as I can, but they're gonna need your help to gain ground. Sure, you sit back this time. I'll take the lead and clear the way. Just keep sending troops to keep the pressure on, and I'll do the rest. There are two cell blocks containing military prisoners outside the main compound. If we break <clears throat> those open, we could probably count on help from the inmates. What else? There's a Dominion base right by the main prison entrance. Take that out and the guards will retreat. The prisoners can handle it from there. All right, Tosh. You ready for this? 
I've been waiting a long time for this. I'm ready. Yeah. Breakout. Boom, boom, boom. Explosion to take out groups of marines. A little trick I call Mind Blast. Damn straight. I do what I want to do. Let's just see about that. Let's do this. Maybe yes, maybe no. <laughs> the bridge it can see me and alert its allies if I get too close even with my stealth Being allied, I should get heals from the... Psy shield. Surrounds Toshin's shield of energy. That's for 10 rounds or until it has absorbed 300 damage. Let's do this. Ow! Ow! Yes. I want to know is where the hell are these guys and why aren't they moving in? In there, Tosh. My boys are moving in to back you up. Finally. Remember, just keep sending in troops, and I'll do the rest.
Let's just see about that. Yeah, that definitely put it up way too high. So let's bring that back down here. Ooh, they're actually making stuff. That's bad. Ow! Nope, 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 nope. on toward the front line. Ow, 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 nope. Fucking SCV. Open your mind. Woods crack in. You're 
securing the first military cell block now. Releasing the prisoners might buy us some allies. Those siege tanks can go away. Perfect. Nice work, Tosh. Freeing those prisoners will really help us out. All right, got Diamondbacks. All right, now that the Raven is down, I can easily take out this left bunker.
busy while we establish our forward position. Bunker, barracks. You know, you could just lift off from your other position. You're close to the second military cell block, Tosh. Feel like making some new friends? Don't you worry about us, Tosh. We'll keep them busy while you free the prisoners. I do what I want to do. Yes. Boys are free. We can bust this place wide open. Great job, Tosh. We got a nuke ready for launch. Paint a target. Just don't call the strike in too close. Oh, we got five. <laughs> Love the bomb. That's funny. Our allies are being 
Tell her about this guy over here. Plus the bonus fifty thousand. Perfect. Hyperion Bridge O three fifty three. Fifty years, and no one's ever escaped from New Folsom. But we broke it open in an afternoon. I hardly believe we pulled it off. You guys did good. Now me and my specters have finished the job. We'll kill Minx. And burn his dominion to the ground. Overthrowing Minx is just the start. This is about building a better tomorrow. Don't you see? We just released every scientist, philosopher, and free thinker that ever challenged Manx's rule. That was our real victory today. You really that naive. Tomorrow there'll be a new Manx, and another one after that. Your great shining dream of the future is just an illusion. So if it's all so bleak, why are you here, Tosh? What do you get out of all this? Same thing as you, brother. I don't quit till Minsk is dead. Vengeance doesn't factor into this. Our revolution's about freedom. <laughs> You'll see that better future, Matt. for the likes of us. That better future. I took a big chance with you and your specters, Tosh. I hope Nova wasn't right about you. <laughs> Don't go believing that little girl's lies. The specter procedure affects everyone differently. But steel human. It's our choice whether to become specters. Not hers. Not yours. Not Minx's. Choice be the only true freedom anyone gets. But can I trust him? Can I trust you? Don't you worry, man. He'll fight for you right to the end. All my brothers and sisters. 
He owes you everything. Thought you'd want to hear. Tosh is officially thrown in with our little revolution. He's gonna lend us his specters to help out. You sure got a soft spot for wayward psychics, Jimmy. Setting those freaks loose ain't smart. Old Meg's got them locked up for a reason. Mix locked them up because they were just weapons to him. They deserve a shot at living their lives outside a cage, just like anyone else. Breaking news. Reports coming in today suggest... What's that? We're, go we're going to Kate, but I... The Dominion's highest value prisoners are loose tonight after a daring raid broke open New Folsom Prison. Dominion security forces are on high alert as some of the prisoners were former members of Project Shadowblade, which we've discovered to be a subversive offshoot of the Dominion's ghost program. A number of political dissidents were also freed during the attack. Do we know who did this, Kate? Was it Rayner's Raiders? The evidence we have suggests it was, Donnie. There you have it. Jim Rayner, making our world just a little more dangerous tonight. From the UNN studios on Core Hall, I'm Donnie Vermillion. More dangerous for the real bad guys, Donnie. You should be worried. <laughs> you should be worried. Alright, nothing should have changed in the laboratory, question mark? Oh, Hanson does have something. Jim, I've been investigating the claims that Nova made about the Spectres turning into psychotic killers. So what'd you find out? Honestly, there's no evidence that Spectres are any more prone to aberrant behavior than ordinary people. A sudden increase in psionic ability could induce a psychotic break, but... Spectres aren't the monsters we were led to believe. Nova lied to us. <laughs> Alright, let's check out the armory. There they are! The Spectres! Spectre. Side effect of the Spectre training regimen is a marked increase in eccentricity. Many Spectres carry totems or other trinkets to enhance their abilities. There is speculation that the Dominion still uses Spectres in a number of op operations, despite the ostensible shutdown of the program. Spectres, tell me, you ever see a Spectre? No, because they don't exist, Gabriel Tosh, rumored to be the first Spectre speaking to Sib Roche of the Emotion News Service. Mr. Roche disappeared a week later and has not been seen since. <laughs> character gave me the data for building more specter gear you sure we can trust that guy i heard he was into brainwashing or something tosh can only recruit volunteers to become specters that's the deal he works them hard so they won't go off the rails when they get their full specter powers no brainwashing involved good to know wouldn't want any of those freaks running loose causing trouble aside from tosh that is <laughs> Did it have any knowledge about or information about their weapons? No. Alright, console. Dominion. Ah, the Spectres. Psionic Lash. Deals 200 damage. Nyx class cloaking module. Cloak no longer requires energy. Absolutely, I need that. Uh, let's go back to the cantina. He didn't have new mercs for me, did he? Mm, that's a negatory. Uh, bridge. Uh, mat. Most days, I don't even know what I'm doing anymore. Just chasing my damn tail. No. We followed your lead from the start. It's your sense of justice that's kept us on this road. Matt, my interest in justice burned out a long time ago. I've spent my whole life fighting. I've killed. I've ordered good men to their deaths. And for what? Finishing this thing with Mengsk. It's all I have left. It's guys like you that'll build something better after all the smoke clears. That's because you gave us something to believe in, sir. I'll never give up the fight. That's a promise. Alright, next mission. So, Tirador. Seems your Queen of Blades figured out who's been paying us to snatch up all them artifacts. Mobius has hit Honcho tucked in a rune. 
seems a Zerg are attacking his main research campus on Tirador. He can't evacuate his people until all their artifact research is safe. <sighs> We've received reports of a new Dominion salvage operation on Tarsus. I think I'd want to do this one next. Running a large number of supply trains with minimal I'm trying to postpone Haven as much as possible. Trains and liberate their contents before they can be shipped off world. We could make a serious profit. All right. <clears throat> Never thought we'd be back to this graveyard again. What have we got, Matt? The Dominion's restored power to the old rail network. They're using the trains to move salvage to a central processing station. Our informants say the Dominions found something unusually valuable, and they're transporting it to the processing station today. It's on one of these trains, but unfortunately they're all scan shielded, so we can't tell which one. We'll have to hit as many as we can and hope we get lucky. Hope we get lucky? That ain't the usual Matt Horner plan. You got a better one, sir. I'm all ears. It's all good, Matt. You sold me. Well, let's go rob ourselves some trains. Old Tychus is gonna love this one. <laughs> the great train robbery. How come it only starts me off with four? Sir, it turns out there are a few Confederate vehicles in the hills the Dominion haven't salvaged yet. Diamondbacks. Man, I didn't think they made it past prototyping. Their rail guns will be great for stopping those trains. No pun intended. I'll upload their schematics to our factory network. There may be other vehicles around that we can commandeer. We should keep our eyes open. You gonna give me orders? <laughs> what? I like it. SCV ready. What's the plan? <laughs> of course. On the move. My pleasure. Excellent. Victory is ours. SCV ready. Of course. Victory is ours. Excellent. At the ready. I like it. On the move. My pleasure. Devious. My pleasure. On the move. Add on. Complete. Excellent. Go on. Of course. How devious. All right, get that going. Bullshit! I need Goliaths! Victory is ours. Additional supply depot is required. Check. What's going on? I'm waiting. I like it. SCV ready. Of course. The train is approaching through a tunnel in the northwest. Insufficient Vespine gas. SCV ready. Gotcha. The doctor is in. Not enough minerals. By the number. What's the plan? SCV ready. Not enough minerals. Pleasure. How 
devious. the train scrap payload to build more units. Insufficient best speed, not enough minerals. Insufficient best speed gas. Huh? Big job, huh? Insufficient best speed gas. Insufficient best speed gas. My pleasure. Isn't that cute? It's got an escort. Commander, I'm picking up increased comm traffic from the Dominion. Sounds like they're planning to attack our base. We better be ready. Of course. Not enough 
Okay, let's get the Goli get the Diamondbacks up here for repairs. Dominion are constructing a series of bunkers to protect the tracks. Be careful. Excellent. Victory is ours. Been waiting on you. By the numbers, boys. Bad news. Will do. Get me an armory. Yo, the boss. Yo, the boss. <laughs> Question is, is where would the other diamond back be? You are not ready to go. It's up there. Everything there is moving. A train is coming through the Western Tunnel. Get me out of here. Let's be ready. Actually, V, let's do the armor first.
force. Yep, there it is. Excellent. Victory is ours. Looks like we found all the Confederate Diamondbacks, sir. This should really help out against the trains. Lay it on me. What's our target? Excuse me. Huh? Roger. The doctor is in. Ah, you scared me. What's on your mind? What's up? You gonna give me orders? Perfect. What? Go on. I'm waiting. Additional supply depots required. On the move. Been waiting. Get me out of here. I'd rather not. Vespine Geyser exhausted. Ugh. Sir, I'm detecting Dominion kill teams patrolling the tracks with large groups of marauders. Go ahead. I'll mark their location with a red warning symbol. Still, you should try to avoid them. Holy crap, Marauders! Holy! Actually, hold up. Just give me Marines. You 
got it. Yes, sir. Outstanding. I feel you. Who wants some? Affirmative. Gangway. Worth it. Vespine Geyser exhausted. Armed and ready. Got it. In the rear. Upgrade here. complete. Go ahead. Gotcha. You want a piece of me, boy? Gonna give me orders? Mineral field depleted. Sure thing. Oh, fuck off. For real? This better be good. Yep. Go ahead. What's going on? In the rear with the gear. What needs killing? Bad news. You gonna give me orders? Armed and ready. Been waiting on you. Why not? By the numbers, boys. Armed and ready. Oh, yeah. Job, huh? You gonna 
give me orders? A train is coming through the Western Tunnel. Looks like the Dominion ran out of whatever they were juicing the trains with. They're putting out bigger escorts, though. We better watch ourselves. What's on your mind? Who wants some? Upgrade complete. In the rear with the gear. Go ahead. This better be good. Who wants some? What needs killing? This better be good. Roger that. Sir, we're detecting electrical activity in the wreckage. Now, let's see what they were so fired up to get their hands on. Adjective 2 dash 4 6 online. System recording. New, new, new Gettysburg Defense Initiative. S submit access codes. Well, I'll be. Better adjutant. What intel so important to go and dig her up to recover it? <laughs> oh, it's so good. <sighs> so much nicer than the first StarCraft. Sir, that adjutant we recovered is down in the lab. She's all powered up. Talk to me, you old piece of junk. Hmm. What do you know? User identified. Rainer, James, ex Marshal Marsara Colony. Joined Sons of Korhal Terrorist Group. Status criminal. Enough about me, darling. What else you got locked up in that synthetic head of yours? User status criminal. Access denied. Playing hard to get, huh? We'll see about that. Robin Trains. We'll make a pirate out of you yet, Mr. Rena. <laughs> <laughs> Robbing a train again get you feeling nostalgic? Damn straight. We must have hit the Shell Express a dozen times back in the day. <laughs> oh, that keeper never got old. Almost got us killed when they smartened up and started using Outriders to chase us. Never was a man of them could keep up with you on a vulture, Jimmy. Just add it to the fun. How the hell you got a job as Marshal after all that? I'll never know. Ladies and gentlemen, each night I bring you the news in the most fair and balanced manner possible. <laughs> but tonight I have a commentary. Some have asked me what the difference is between our leader, Emperor Mengsk, and the traitor, Jim Rayner. They point out that Mengsk rebelled against the government of his youth and came to power through the use of violence and subversion. Why is it wrong for Jim Rayner to rebel in similar fashion? There is a difference. When Emperor Mansk began his revolution, there was no threat hanging over humanity. James Rayner is waging his revolution while we are at war with two alien races. James Rayner, have you no conscience? Shouldn't you fall in line, putting your petty complaints aside as we struggle for humanity's very survival against this alien menace? Everyone's a critic. <laughs> uh, let's see. I don't believe there was a new mercenary. No. Because all we have left next is Banshee Viking and then the battlecruisers. 
So let's check out the lab. This latest research is terrible. Jim, let me in. What really happened on Tarsonis? Whatever it was, I can see it tearing you up inside. Tarsonis. That's where it all went down. Meng stole a psi emitter from the Confederacy and planted it there. He knew that it'd attract the Zerg and... Our revolution began that day. The day Mengsk murdered a whole planet and called it justice. My god. Billions of innocent people. That's... That's just... Monstrous. No wonder you hate him so much. Alright, Zerg tank. Stepman Log, entry 2297. Zerg sample has developed the nocular organ. Will limbs be next? There is a basic dichotomy to Zerg cell reproduction. Type A cells throw off seemingly random mutations. Type B cells hunt down these mutations and destroy them. Survival of the fittest on the cellular level. Successful mutations thrive. I used microscopic scrapings from the sample to test an electrical discharge field I'd been tinkering with for some time. Results were gratifying. As an interesting side effect, the Zerg matter developed into very dense but flexible material. This material could be used to reinforce the superstructure of those old Hercules-class cargo ships that Swan's always trying to find a use for. I wish there were time to pursue both the discharge field and iterate on the hardened matter. I doubt there will be. Interesting. Alright, so we have the option of the Predator, the anti-infantry specialist with a powerful area of attack. Or we can go with the Hercules transports. We can deploy loaded troops almost instantly. I think I want the Hercules. Problem is, is like Zerg research is such garbage compared to Protoss research. Uh, that was Cantina. Let's check out the Armory. Yeah, yeah, good old days, robbing trains, yada yada, bang bang. Yeah. I'm making Diamondbacks. I'm making Diamondbacks. <laughs> oh, Swan. Alright, vehicles, diamondback. We have trilithium power cells. Oh, plus one range. Gotcha. Uh, plus 50 life. Let's see, multi lock weapon system. I should get that. Bunker stuff. Or er, Terran building. Fire suppression system. This is on all structures prepare themselves to 50% life. Fires are put out immediately. Yeah, I'll probably need that. Orbital command. You can also call down mules. Yes! Okay, so now I can't afford that. But we can get the multi-lock, which is actually really good for the Goliath. So we can at least do that. Alright, uh, bridge. Talk to Matt. I've been looking for an encryption expert so we can access the adjutant we recovered. No luck so far. Colonel Orlin at Dead Man's Port can crack anything. Haven't been back there in a while. Say, didn't you end up getting married last time we were there? I told you before. If I knew what the prize was, I never would have joined that card game. Huh? There's just something about a lover's reunion that chokes me up. <laughs> Alright, so mission-wise, we have Dead Man's Port, Tirador. We still need to access the adjutant we retrieved from Tarsonis. Our old mercenary associate, Colonel Orlin, is an expert in Confederate code decryption. If our intel's right, he should still be based at the Murk Haven at Dead Man's Port. He's not... Alright, I actually want to go back to the laboratory. Let's save... And let's do another crystal. I gathered allies. We made our way to the Forbidden Archive world a 
Kozaku. There, a triumvirate of mystic preservers awaited us. And in the shadows, something else was watching and waiting. All right, consult the preservers on Zakul, and there's a chance for three and three for both research. All right, Zeratulo, buddy, you've got your mysterious prophecy. Now let's see what your preservers made of it. My quest to decipher the prophecy took me to the forbidden archive world of Zakul. Here, three immortal preservers guarded ancient knowledge. Only they could transcribe the prophetic fragments. I needed to seek them out quickly. A sinister turn. strangely silent here yet these structures are intact with power they would be functional That's a lie. Twilight Council, Cybernetics Core, Gateway, Forge. The mighty spirits of the preservers are imprisoned close by. We must find them. So the preservers are all the way down there. structures in this place that we can make use of. They merely need their power restored by the construction of a few well-placed pylons. The preservers you seek serve a higher power now, Dark One. Something foul has taken hold of this sacred place. Enough minerals. You have not enough. Highlight! 
for hire. Ula Sadari. Hot guides me. Antara Tassadar. Kassar de Templari. By your will. Oh. Of course, I built the the other photon cannon on the wrong side. is draining the preservers to survive. I must free them before it is too late. Facility. This structure may prove useful to us. Fuck. 
Once power is restored, it could be of great value to us. Old is the void. You have not enough minerals. This Templar archive lies abandoned. Yourself, noble warrior, we confront a terrible evil this day. Require my skills. I return to serve. Uh oh. Shit. Oh, could you run any slower?
Ooh, I could do an Archon merge. We shall stand against the darkness. of the preservers are entombed within. We must break them open immediately. Okay. a part to play in this prophecy. I must seek out the Overmind's final resting place, our ancient homeworld of Iron. Okay. Yay, new research. You look spooked. You've been seeing what the Protoss has to show you. The memories shine through you as clear as day. I saw hybrid. Something unnatural. It was trying to corrupt the Protoss preservers. Who would have sent it there? 
Who controls something like that? The one that made them for sure. That was just the first of many. Dark harbingers, man. Soon they'll be beyond numbering. And the stars will weep at what comes after. How could you know all this? I don't. I just feel it be true. <laughs> Level 800, Elite Torrent <laughs> Chieftain is back with a new album of pulse pounding rock that will shake the galaxy. Rock out with such hits as Rogues Do It From Behind, Terran Up the Night, Another Hydralisk Bites the Dust. Saturday That's actually a friggin' amazing track. Terran Up the Night is such a good track. Such a good track, tearing up the night. I don't think your buddy Horner likes me very much. Laboratory. <laughs> All right, the Zerg tank. Zerg uh, Stepman Log Entry 2354. Zerg sample has developed a large neural cortex. I've noticed it reacting to external stimuli, but in a very disturbing way. When it detects my presence, it stops moving. Is it trying to play dead? Can it react at that level? I noticed earlier that Zerg alpha amino acids have unique R groups. I've run a full regimen on some. Results are stunning. Zerg aminos are able to combine dead cell matter with normal proteins to biosynthesize new cells. They don't suffer generational cell degradation. Simply put, a Zerg will never die of old age. They can constantly renew themselves, albeit with radically changing cell structure. We could never harness their, uh, this book for biological use with Terrans. The results would be foregone and horrifying, but I, I wonder if I could alloy Zerg tissue with some of our metals to make buildings that heal. Renewal process also throws off immense energy as a byproduct. Something there. I should see about harnessing that energy. Let's check out the Protoss tank. Stepman Log Entry 2299. I've been staring at an anomalous sphere above the crystal. It's obviously an energy emitter, but it has such strong containment that the crystal can slowly draw power from it via some method that I don't understand. Gives me an idea. Using our own containment technology, I can modify our SCV manufacturing process to double capacity with no increased risk, I think. Breakthrough. Energy in this crystal is not kept in a vortex pattern. It was warping the energy around so fast that I couldn't detect it. In an odd coincidence, the warping slowed just enough for my sensors to pick it up. Not sure how or why. Every time I reach my wit's end with this sample, something happens by chance and I get a breakthrough. Is it helping me? Clearly I've been working too many hours. I'm going to lose some more credits on Lost Viking. <laughs> All right, let's take a look at the research panel. All right, I want automated refinery because that's going to free up my SCV production. All right, ships and vehicles slowly regenerate life. Specialist unit skin, no, regenerative biosteel. Way like that's the easiest decision possible. Be careful, Jim. I think you're losing yourself in that crystal. Yeah. Uh, yeah, okay. Have you seen my stapler? Little hint, it's red. <laughs> I've never actually heard that line. That's fantastic. Welcome back, sir. What did you discover from the crystal this time? It's that obvious I used it, huh? Zeratul took the prophecy fragments he found to a temple, library. Kind of both, I guess. But this weird Protoss Zerg hybrid had taken over the place. You mean some sort of infested Protoss? No, this wasn't like infestation at all. It was like someone took the strengths of both races and twisted them together. I gotta tell you, if these things are real, we're in a lot of trouble. Let's go to the armory. What's up, cowboy? You know, you're looking kind of rough lately. Rougher than usual, I mean. I've, uh... Got a lot going on right now, Swan. You know how it is. Yeah, sure. You know, you might want to try laying off the sauce. You get some shut eye once in a while. 
Huh? Thanks, Mom. I'll get right on that. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Uh, yeah, let's do crystals. Some more crystal. Let me save. Alright. One thing I do want to do real quick is take a quick bio break. So, let's... Take that quick bio break. So we'll be right right back, everyone. Take this chance to get up, use the restroom if you need to, stretch your legs, grab a snack, refresh your drink. We will be right back with some more StarCraft 2. Don't go anywhere. We're back. Come on. There it goes. Alright, let's get back into this. I return to our ruined homeworld of Iron. The Zerg infestation still covered much of our beloved world. The desiccated remains of the Overmind were still there. A grim reminder lost and battles won all right seek out the overmind on ire i remember the fall of ire almost like the ip 
idea of having to see it all again. Guess there's nothing for it. At the very apex of its victory against us, the Zerg Overmind grew overconfident. Now, all that was left of the mighty Overmind was a twisted, withered husk. I needed to understand whatever memories lingered within the creature's rotting mass. Only by making contact with the gargantuan tendrils connected directly to its cortex could I learn its secrets. <coughs> Yet its countless minions, which seemed to be feeding from its dead husk, would prove somewhat problematic. All right, Echoes of the Future. Uh, I gotta bring Zeratul to all the different tendril appendages of the Overmind, so that way he can get the memories! I must find a way to establish a foothold and summon reinforcements to keep the Zerg at bay. En Arudi. Ah, this faithful observer has kept watch since the evacuation. Its abilities will certainly prove useful now. Fulfill my calling. In the service of Aya, my burdens, Shozak Makno. Honor. I will erase the demons of the past. You address me? Some of these abandoned structures remain functional. We shall make use of them. This ancient beacon still thrums with power. I wonder... <laughs> ah, the Colossi. Oh, I've heard tales of the mighty Colossi sealed away beneath ire. The beacon must have awoken these fearsome guardians. The Zerg perceive a threat to their dead master. That's fine. The Zerg will keep coming until we are dead. I must find the Overmind's cortex and discover what I can from it. Observers wisely, we can scout the area before putting ourselves at risk.
Yeah, let me build more. We must be prepared to defend our base. The Zerg are on the move. You have not enough minerals. All right, just need to get production up and running so that way I can actually do something. I will erase the demon. Seek to overwhelm us to arms, my brethren. Oh, really?
Ben Arudi, state thy bidding. of ire. Overmine tendril. I sense pain, surprise, death. Zerg seek to overwhelm our base. Not hesitate. Alright, so these must be where, like where Rainer's base was in the storyline.
interest. Fulfill my calling. Okay. We must not hesitate. Service of iron. Zerg are coming. is under attack. Second over my tendril, I sense death and joy. I will be Shazak Maknol. Mineral field depleted. I will fulfill my calling.
right, give me the Dark Archon, or Dark Templar, I should say. I suppose I should also probably have a regular Templar Archive, too, at some point. Put you over here for now, because I'll send you over here eventually. My burdens weigh. So I'd actually really like to get an Archon. A couple of Archons, actually. Shields. Under a shadow, the Zerg will attack soon. Base is under attack. Ah, fuck, of course they would attack here. All right. Upgrade complete. I'd like to finish building my base now, if you please. You address me. All right. I was going this direction. Oh. 
I will erase the deep Hassan de Templar. All right, Archons. All right, how much do Templars cost? Most of it. near our base. Fill my calling. <laughs> the thing is stuck. Put that on a control five. I will erase the demons of the past. You address me. In the service of my Vespine Geyser exhausted. The Zerg 
would seek to overwhelm us. To arms, my brethren. Okay, get the defenses up for this outpost. Yeah, whatever, that can be destroyed. Don't care. Long time for that one. All right, get the Archons up there. The Zerg seek to overwhelm our base.
the fourth over mine, Tendril. I sense an end. I must go to the Overmind Cortex to understand. Greetings, brother. I speak to you from the beyond. Tassadar. But you died. Slaying this cursed overmind. I have never tasted death, Zeratul, nor shall I. But that is a tale for another time. I have come to tell you of this creature's courage. Courage? It was an abomination. forced upon them the destruction of our people. The Overmind was formed with thought and reason, but not with real. Hmm. It screamed and raged within the prison of its own mind. Who did this? its all-consuming directive. It created a chance, a hope of salvation. The Queen of Blades. Madness. Only she can free the Zerg from slavery. And in so doing, save all that is. Understand, brother. Forget what you know, Zeratul. The Overmind saw a vision. The end of all things. And now, you must see it too. No. This vision. I cannot. Bear it. Stop. <laughs> and thus he saw the future's end. Something that put him on a collision course with the Protoss. It's all gone wrong. Everything's twisted. And there's something out there that's set to destroy us all. Zerg. Protoss. He's our strong recess. How terrible. How powerful is something that plays with their feats? <laughs> <laughs> it's funny. Be careful, Jim. I think you're losing yourself in that crystal. You know, I've been watching the logs. Those damn Protoss are still way ahead of us. I can't believe some of the stunts they can pull off. Tell me about it. They've learned some new tricks since the last time we <sighs> I mean, come on. Since when could they warp in guys just anywhere? I thought they needed some kind of gateway at least. Not just anywhere. 
They need a pylon or another power source close by. Still, they've been working to improve their tech, just like us. <laughs> Damn, Matt. I don't even know what to make of this last vision from the crystal. Zeratul was looking for more clues about the end of the universe. But this time, he was on Ire. Ire? What was he looking for? He was trying to find out why the Overmind made the Queen of Blades in the first place. She's the one that's going to destroy the universe? No. That's just it. I think she's the only one that can save it. <laughs> and there it is, boys and girls. <laughs> Alright. It is time to save and call it there for the evening. We're going to find ourselves someone that we can raid and go say hello to. All right. Who should we raid tonight live? Let's go raid Nerd Rage Quit. We haven't raided him in quite a while. He's playing some Apex Legends tonight. All right. I want to thank everyone for joining me tonight. Uh, we might be back sometime this weekend. We'll see how uh, we'll see how everything goes. It is Mother's Day weekend. Odds are we probably won't be back for another stream until uh, next Monday. But just in case we are, please stay tuned, and we will see you on the next one. Have a good evening, everyone.